Hey everybody, today in this uh, Weebly lesson we're going to learn how to work a little bit with columns in your Weebly pages. Here we are on my About page. It doesn't have a layout, all it has is a header, it's got the menu and so on. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with a layout and we're going to choose a layout for an About page that we can use and let's choose this one here let's say and it's gonna load our layout and we're gonna keep this layout so now we have a layout selected and down here you can see we have uh, four separate areas clients awards publications interviews let's say we're happy with that except we only need three columns okay instead of four or maybe it's two whatever you need it to be so we're gonna say three let's say we don't need uh, publications so we're gonna hover over here and whenever you hover over an element in Weebly you will get the little blue outlined box and this is where we control what we can do with these columns alright so we want to get rid of the publications column so we're going to go to the header here for publications we're going to go up we're going to click this X to delete okay and there goes our publications header we're going to do the same for the text in this column we're going to delete that so now we have our three columns and you can see that Weebly automatically when we deleted that column automatically brings it together okay so that's very handy you don't have to resize or anything like that now let's say for example you wanted uh, two columns but you wanted one column to be larger than the other let's say we want to get rid of interviews so we're going to do the same thing for interviews we're going to get rid of it we're going to delete and now you'll see Weebly will resize that so that it's 50-50. Okay, now you would probably want to center maybe like so. Just to make it look uh, nice and neat. Okay, so there you go. So there's our two columns. Now let's say we want the clients column to be larger. Let's say we want it to be three quarters clients column, one quarter awards column. Okay, what we're going to do is we are going to click and drag to do so. So if we hover down in this area, you see now we get this line in between. Okay, and now when you hover your mouse over that line, you can also see that we get our little arrow pointing in both directions. Now if we click and we drag that over you will see that our clients column gets larger than our awards column okay now if you just point and click on this just one click you will see that we get a spacing uh, box that we can use to resize the columns as well uh, so if we click this minus you see that the spacing changes okay the spacing between the two columns this isn't the size of the columns this is the spacing between the two columns so if we go to 50 60 70 you see the space getting wider if we go back down to uh, 20 the space gets smaller again okay now what if we have a column where or a situation where we really don't have a layout we just want to add some columns to our um, to our page so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go up to build and what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a uh, text we're gonna add a couple of text boxes so I'm gonna drag a text box right to uh, here Okay, and now I'm going to call this column one. Okay, now I'm going to drag another text box over 
here. I'm going to drop it. Okay. And now I'm going to call this column two. And now I'm going to add a third text box over beside column two. Just going to drop it right there. And now this is going to be column three. And there you see we have added three columns now. And let's say we wanted column one to be bigger than column two and three. We just drag as we normally would. And now column one is larger than column two and column three. And you can do that anywhere on any Weebly page and with any layout. See, even up here we have a picture or we should have had a picture. It's not showing up for whatever reason. Um, but let's say we wanted the text to be a little wider. We just go to that column, we drag it over, and now we've changed the size of our columns. So you can see it's very, very simple to work with Weebly and columns and make your pages look uh, however you want. If you have any questions about columns, about Weebly, please leave them in the comments or you can visit my website. You can see that uh, in the description of the, the video. I'd be happy to help you out with any questions you might have. And I hope you enjoyed this Weebly tutorial on working with columns. Take care and have a good day.